Hi everyone, this is Sarah with the ShareASell Client Success Team. Today's video is about voiding or editing sales. Any changes that need to be made to a transaction can be made by going to the Reports, Transaction Detail Report page. Here you are able to see a breakdown of each transaction. So first off, I think it is important to remind you that all transactions are able to be edited until they lock. You can see an individual transaction's potential lock date right here underneath the total of the sale. It will be in green until it locks and turns gray. The rule is that all transactions lock on the 20th of the month following the sale. So for example, this sale that was made today would lock on September 20th, 2020. This time before the transaction locks is for you as the merchant to monitor your affiliate program. And it's a safety guard against any fraud. So if you need to edit this sale, you would select edit up here. You can make changes to the sale amount commission or add a comment. You should keep in mind that changes are sent to the corresponding affiliates. So we suggest that if you're going to make any unexpected changes that you notify your affiliates in order to keep the relationship strong. If you are actually making a change, you would press update transaction to make those edits. If you toggle over history, you can see if any edits were made and when they were made. Our other option is to void a transaction. Again, affiliates will be notified, so we strongly advise against doing this without any reason. You will be asked to select the reason for voiding the transaction before you can complete this change. Once a transaction has been voided, the lock date will turn to a red voided and you are no longer able to edit the transaction. I hope this better explains how to edit and void transactions in the transaction detail report. Reach out to client success at shareasale at shareasale.com or submit a help ticket if you are having any other issues. Thanks so much.